You know, one of the things a magician does is to ask himself one question. What's real and what's illusion? For instance, what could be more real than a newspaper? We already know that everything you read in the paper is true. So here we've got this newspaper. It's very solid and it's very real. Now, if I were to tear this paper into shreds, it would become a torn up newspaper, wouldn't it? It would be impossible to put the paper back to its original one piece. Or would it? So that you recognize this paper when you see it again later, I'd like you to find a picture and add something from within that will help you recognize this paper when you see it again later on. And now the illusion begins. I call this an illusion because it actually looks like I've torn the paper. The illusion is actually aided by the fact that it sounds like I'm tearing the paper. People have come up to me afterwards and said, you know, Chuck, I could have sworn that you tore that paper. They're led to believe this by the senses that they have trusted all of their lives with their eyes and their ears. They actually think that they, they, that they see separate pieces falling to the floor. But they've been deceived. You see, I've actually not torn this paper at all. You can't always trust your senses. You don't believe me? Take a look. And the back, the inside, the inside, and the inside. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is the mystery of the Torn and Restored newspaper, and I thank you.